So earlier today, I shared my little aha, silly moment story about the microwave. And uh, tonight, I just wanted to share how that showed up a little bit uh, in my parenting with helping my child with their core wounds and limiting beliefs and kind of how it relates. Um, so a few times throughout the day today, uh, my kids were off school for s snow days the last couple days. And I said, tomorrow you're going back to school. Make sure you have all your stuff ready. Make sure you've got your uniform set out and ready to go. A few reminders. Lo and behold, 10 minutes before bedtime, my kid says, I need my uniform washed. And my reaction, I was a little annoyed. I said, why is this uh, be brought to my attention right before bed? I'm not really looking to do laundry right now. She knew I was feeling a little irritated and I told her, I said, yeah, I, I'm feeling a little irritated and like I wasn't being heard or listened to today or disregarded. And I heard her made a comment about herself, um, something about how she was just a bad kid or she does, she, something's wrong with her. Um, so I could tell that was striking that kind of core wound of something's wrong with me. I'm bad inherently. And so as I was tucking her into bed, I told her the microwave story and how just because I was getting irritated or had those thoughts going in my head, didn't mean there was anything wrong with the microwave and explained to her how she's a young girl, she's learning and maybe didn't get it quite right that day and, you know, following directions or listening or um, meeting my expectation. That was an expectation I had. And just because I had feelings of being irritated or annoyed did not reflect on her that inherently anything is wrong with her or that she's bad. She's a good kid. She just needed her uniform washed. Did I wish I would have known a little earlier? Yeah. All in all, it turned out to be okay in the end. And she said, thank you, mommy, for explaining that to me. And she could see the parallel and was able to go to bed on a, on a good note.